All right, the map is New Zealand and Australia, and these are the bonuses, two, six, five, two, three, two, two, three, five, four, three, four, four, and four. And we're the yellow player, third in the turn order. And this blizzard makes it into a one, two, three, four point hold for the greater Western Australia, plus six. Looks like uh, blue wants to go for this. And this blizzard makes it into a, I think this still connects here, so it's still a three point hold for that plus two. And over here, this plus three is now split. This plus two has, it doesn't affect anything really. Probably make this harder to hold. This blizzard makes it one less point to hold this. It's still like a one, two, three, four, five point hold. This blizzard does nothing. This blizzard splits this plus four and a half. So it's uh, once this person clears that out, actually these blizzards here make it into a one, two, three, four, five point hold for that. It's still a lot, but better than six. These two blizzards make this plus three into a one, two, three point hold. That's all right. Magenta with a god spawn over here. Going to get their plus two right away. That's really strong for them. It's only a plus two though. I'm kind of strong for this plus three, but a lot in the way. Wait a second. Once you clear out all of this, you you could uh, wait one, two, three point hold for this plus four and this plus three and blocking this plus four is actually this is really nice, actually, once I can get it, unless this guy gets too strong. I need Magenta not be over here. Uh, also, there's this as well. Magenta probably goes for that next. I mean, is there a world where I can get this bonus this turn with good dice? Good dice. We got that good dice again. Good dice again. And then we fortify this over into here. And if somebody wants to break me, it's very easy for them to do so. But it'll either hit that plus four this turn or hit nothing. And if they break this, whatever, next turn I work on getting this out of here, maybe that. And in two or three turns, if I can get a hold, you know, over here, here, and here, it'll be a while before I can push that four out, though. Here's the thing. I just realized Red has seven troops there. They probably want this too. No, they're going over here. That's great for us. They're attacking over there. I don't, I don't do, do these even touch? It looks, I'm not sure if those touch or not, but uh, they, they got a plus two as well. That's only a two point hold for that plus two. Try to actually get everything on screen here. And they're attacking out that way. That's actually good for me. If they fortify that out, then, ooh, are, are they gonna fortify in? I would like to eventually be holding that right there. So if they're smart, they fortify that three on my way, but they're not, they're fortifying this direction. They, they might be going for this territory if I'm lucky. Green stacking there and just getting a card over here. No, they're getting a nice little uh, plus two bonus over there. They're gonna try and break me. Bad dice. One in three chance to succeed, and it did not succeed. Lucky. Gonna come down this way and try and break me. They're saying well played. So red's giving them a pat on the back for trying to break me. They fortify back out of there. That's fine. Blues over here. Okay. So looks like I get to hold my bonus. Getting a uh, seven troops next turn. Actually, possibly eight. The question is, do I focus on clearing this out and trying to shore up here, here, and here, or maybe here? Or do I instead just, you know, hit green out of here and then, you know, fortify this, this three point up a little bit more? Six for magenta. This guy keeps seeing well played and good luck constantly. It's distracting. I'm going to mute you. You're talking just for the sake of talking. That's my job. I just find it very distracting. I'm trying to think about something that every two seconds is like, good luck, well played, good luck, well played. Cannot focus, Captain. Yeah, they got this. They're going to try and shore that up. They're going for this. They are stacking over there for defensively, which means I think that does touch. I mean, they should just grab this, and then it becomes a one, two, three point hold blocking blue as well. What's blue going to do about it? They have no bonus. They're going for another bonus over here. I'm worried red might be wanting to come into here. I mean, they moved away. They didn't fortify in. If I hit their three there, they might be mad. Green gets four troops. Gonna have eight coming through. I'm just gonna try and hold my bonus. Having this bonus here is good for me. I'll put two here to hit that. I just want people to not want to come into my general area is what I would like. Actually, I put them all over here. Will actually be like a, a lot more points to hold right now than I want. But the purpose of this is to make it um, a little undesirable for anybody to attack me. Maybe they don't. No, maybe nobody wants to attack a three or a four early. It would be nice for me. And signal that I'm going for this general region, and maybe this guy sees, you know, four, seven, ten, thirteen troops around his three and kind of like leaves. It occurs to me, I have this two here. Wait a second, I'm done. This does not connect to this over here. I don't need that three there. So it's a one, two point hold. Even better. Three if I want to hold this bonus over here, which, I mean, what is that? A plus four? Well, I had to go through green over here to get that, so don't worry about that. And this blizzard, I just realized now, makes it into a one, two, three point hold for this bonus instead of four. Blizzard awareness is important. 
Oh, is red going for that bonus above me? Red's going for this bonus above me. They want the plus five in South Queensland. I mean, if I'm getting plus seven, them getting plus five is not a big deal. Wow, they're already getting plus two, so they'd be getting, um... They, they'd also be getting plus seven. And that forced me into a one, two, three point hold instead of a one, two point hold. Wait, no, they, for they moved out of it. They moved out. They're not going for it. Green's chilling over there. What is that bonus? Plus four? I don't care about you getting a plus four over there. I'm more concerned about protecting what I've got. Wait a second. You've got plus six. Again, that's not that big of a deal. I don't want to fight early because that could be bad for me. I just want to be unassailable. And a two-point hold on plus seven is pretty unassailable. Are you a bot? You bought it out. Don't know why. Okay, so blue's a bot. That's good to know. This is progressive, right? It is progressive. Magenta's doing really well because they got their plus two nice early and they haven't been fighting as much to get other stuff, I don't think. I mean, I got mine early too. I think I've just been attacking more. Plus, they've had their troop income already. They're going good neighbor with the red player. They're not going in to break them. It's only a plus two, right? Why make them mad on a plus two? The good news for me, like magenta and green are both very strong, but the good news for me is that blue is a bot and blue is rampaging here, here, and might eventually break them. Unless it just wants to dance around in here. Red's having a bad day, just get in a plus two. They need to get my th they need to get my three out there. We'll put that mini right there. We'll put that over there. We'll hit over to here to complete our bonus. We'll hit over to here to show up our defense a little bit. Then we'll fortify uh, this three over onto here for safety. If green player wants to break me, they can. Hopefully they understand I'm just protecting my bonuses. Green only has 23 troops. I don't think they want this fight with me. They're How are they so low on troops? I guess they attacked a lot to get that bonus. They had attack through to get this one and attack through to get this one. Red player putting all it right there. They're going to hit that right there. That way they can get this extra bonus, right? No, they're going for this plus two instead of the plus three. All right. They're going for both. That gets them up to a seven. They got plus seven. I've got plus seven. They've got more territories, but they also have to block on more locations, though, to be fair. Are you slow rolling green? Okay, red's going to war with green and getting terrible dice. Wait, you had seven. Seven V3 is guaranteed also. Just hit the two. Red might be someone on the beginner side. They they had a... Yeah, oh, now they see the two. I, it feels like they listen. Oh, good dice. They finally got lucky. 7v3 is guaranteed in Balanced Blitz, and 6v2 is guaranteed in Balanced Blitz. They didn't need to do that. And now they're vulnerable to getting broken here. This is great for me. Let these two fight each other. I don't know why they decided to do that. Hopefully they're just stacking. Okay, yeah, green's just stacking there defensively because they're scared of, you know, my big seven next to them. That's fine. They're protecting up their little borders. It is progressive. You can be in last place and still come back to win just by getting a nice kill on somebody. Green just attacking for some cards, just trying to leave that area. Try to keep some troops alive. Here's the thing. Do I want to push green out of here? It makes it easier for somebody else to get the kill on green. Magenta's got a kill ground on green no matter what I do. Keeping green alive over here is good because it makes it harder for Magenta to get the kill on green. Magenta's big mad. I don't think they realize that blue is a bot. All right, the bot seems to want uh, South Queensland. Oh, no, but it's fortifying back over here. Oh, that's good. That's good for us. Yes, bot. Pressure them. Can I take this and roll it out and grab this? It's a one, two, three, four point hold. A one, two, because this connects over here. One, two, three, four, five. No, no, thank you. I'll take my two point hold for plus seven and just catch up on troops. This guy's got 52. How do you have so many troops? That. That. Plus six. I think you got it earlier and you fought less. Boom! Lost 16 out of 14. Balance Blitz did you no favors these days. All right, that that evens up the board a little bit. Who's easy to eliminate? The bot and then red. The bot being here is actually good for us. We don't want a card trade here yet. I do need to get a card though. That's what we'll do is we will hit over here for a little card like so. And then we'll fortify, I guess, this three onto here. I could put on my three to try and keep that alive maybe. 10 for the red player, they're doing all right. But we got 12 and 11 protecting us a little bit better. I don't love having to stack next to green's bonus right here, but I'm not going to leave a gap here. These three blizzards doing amazing things for me. Magenta's giving them mad face. They don't like that the red player stacked defensively next to them. I don't think the red player thinks in terms of like good relations and, oh, we'll do a trust exercise. I think the red player's perhaps newer. 
We are now in the lead on troops. Love that. When the bot gets up to three cards, it could be worth to go through and just take them out. The, the pathing's pretty clean for getting the kill on a bot. Trading for eight. Ooh, stacking it all next to Magenta because they want Magenta's bonus. That's great for me. That is great for me. Magenta's having a bad day. Question is, do we let green hold this next to us? Because that would give them a plus... That's only a plus eight. Do I care if they have a plus eight? They're saying thanks? Ooh, bad dice there. It's So they don't even get it. It's, it they're still only getting plus four. Well, I don't care about that. Let them have it. So blue and magenta are weak. Magenta made a mistake trying to attack the blues, like, 14 stack. Bot wants to make it hard for me to get a card, huh? It's going to attack there, and I'm going to have to, like, hit, to like, a two or a three. No, go that way, yeah. No, I'm going to have to hit, like, a two or a three for a card. I guess unless I try a card trade down here. Did I earlier say that magenta had a kill guard in greed? They don't. I have a path right here. Brain, work better. I just realized I also have a path up to here. This connects up to here, I didn't even realize. Is that why Magento is giving the mad face my stack here? Or did they give the mad face my stack here? Anyways. Looks like they're going to focus on trying to grab this bonus instead. Probably better than being split across the board. The bot kill is going to get easier. I want them to have one more card before I kill them. Is it worth it for two cards? I don't know that I want to spread myself across the board. Weaken my troops up. I just have two big stacks. That boss could probably hit my two there, but it is what it is. Stack those there. We'll put five here. Put these here. We'll hit for a little card over here. If the bot doesn't hit that three, I want to be able to fortify things to good positions. Now we got a 17 and an 18 protecting us. It's very nice. 11 for the red player. I've got 50 troops. We're in the lead because we managed to scout out the best starting position. And we are decently strong for it and looking great. Red just defending up here like crazy. Not really defending here that much. And they're slow rolling a 5v3. That makes sense, because that's not guaranteed, right? And they get it. And that gives them another bonus. Oh, they're fortifying, huh? Yeah, they're trying to protect everything. So now they've got a uh, 2, 5, 7. That's a plus 9 and a lot of, you know, extra territory bonuses. And how many points is that to defend? You got trust exercise the magenta over there and over here. And you're, so you're blocking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, <laughs> 6... Seven, like eight different spots? You're so spread out. They've got five cards. Taking them out would give me a double card trade. Where are the card trades at? I mean, 10? I get 22? I don't know. Is it worth it to take you out? It might be. Five cards? It's 40 troops, though, which would cost me 30 to take you out, so it's not worth it to take you out. It's like 75% to take out 40 costs like 30 of mine. I only get probably about 30 back, if that. Magenta getting strong over there. I don't know that I want green getting uh, that plus eight next to me. The bot's got three cards. We take them out for cards. The choice is simple. A nice bot kill. Give us these ten trades. Don't use the wild. Let's go for a little bot elimination over here. That's what I want in my life. The question is, can I do another elimination after it? I don't know. We are going to go ahead and get this job done, though. Make sure we're Always hit him with 11 or 100%. Oh, the pathing here is sloppy and gross. Don't like it. Oh, well. You'll have to deal with it and leave some weird stacks everywhere. I could put some more down here to like be a little more efficient, right? And we'll go ahead and grab all of this. Uh, is that one connect? It does. There's the kill in the bot. I've got, I still have 62 troops. Uh, Magenta only has three cards. That would be another card trade if I can take out Magenta. They got 26 troops. Can I do it with this? Say the wild. Can I do it with a, a 24 stack? No, I don't think I can. So what we do is... Do I line for another kill? Don't care about my bonus? Oh, go for green? Where do I put the stack at? We... Put it here for safety. And then we fortify... This back over to here to keep myself protected. And we chill out. Although the problem of doing that is green, oh, there's a big card trade for me. Green is going to look at this as me wanting to eliminate them, but they don't have a card trade. That's why I went ahead and did that. I didn't say it out loud. That's why. Red's going to get the kill on Magenta right now. Okay, well played. Yep, okay, that's fine. And I need a card trade in three. We have one because we kept the wild card. So you can't uh, break me. I take you out next turn with a card trade. 
And then after I take you out, I go through and break all of your bones so you don't get as much. And I'm one v one the red player here. Th unless they fail the kill. <laughs> unless they fail the kill. Wait, that's going to feed the kill to green. No, it's not because they'd have to go through all of red's territory to reach there. Actually, they go from here. I mean, they could hit this, 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 but they don't have a card trade. I mean, they might have enough troops. Oh, smart, smart, red, smart, red. They saw that they failed the kill, so they blocked the green player from getting it. Although, to be fair, it's better for them, for green to get them for me. You're going to self-destruct on me with that 22, aren't you? No, they give up. Now, the thing is, Magenta could have a card trade on three. They do not, and they want to retaliate against red, because red's the one that just messed them up. All I did was take out the bot. If anything, they like me for taking out the bot, because the bots attacked them. Uh, or the bot messed them up early, right? Ooh, they still they get that 1v3, okay. Green only has two cards. Red has three. Uh we card trade here. Should we do we? No, we don't. We stack um I don't know how many do we need over here? Like that many? Green's positioning is better though, frankly. Go for this, for this, for this. We hit uh, a little bit of this over here. We hit um or cry laughing. Who do I hit next? Green. So we hit next. Take advantage of the timer. I'll work and finish you guys uh, later. Just want your. I want these. I want to claim my stuff over here. We hit this as well, and I can path up through this way. Once the timer gets low, I'm going to go ahead and finish you off. I'm just doing this for like take advantage of how the t the timer resets. Okay, we're running low on time. Now we take care of uh, you like so, and that takes advantage of how the turn timer resets only on the card trade. Makes more work on green. We sit these over here. We card trade like so. It's fine. And we need to finish green if at all possible. So let's go ahead and do that best we can. Hit you here. Hit you here. There we go. A little bit of this over here. We hit you behind like so. And we'll hopefully not... We should be fine on dice right here. Yeah, fine. Um... Hit you again. Does not give me immediate card trade occurs. Oh, wait, no. It did? It did. Huge. Uh, paying attention with CG. All right, we're going to go ahead and hit down here like this. We're going to leave uh, six to hit over into you like so. And nope, we're going to go ahead and break everything you have. We'll hit this first. Only leave three. Hit this. Go through here. Hit this. Does that connect up there? It does not. Okay. Thought it did. All right. Need to do more damage on you, frankly, before you get your card trade river. Can we go? Can we go faster? Can we go better? We can. We got one plus two, but it is what it is. Hit this. Hit that. All right. Ran out of time, but you've, even with the card trade, I've got 105 troops. You've got 18. I got four cards. You've got three. Not a lot you can do here, apart from breaking a few bonuses. No car trade on three makes my life even easier. Oh, they finally came down and broke this. This thing was amazing for us. It did so much. You can probably unmute you now. They're trying their best. The game's over, but they, they don't know it yet. Oh, no dice for you there. 43 troops for us is insane with it. You cleaned a perfect path for me, so I can all put them in one spot. Car trade as well. They're cry laughing over there. Yeah, this guy's been spamming emotes the whole game. Good game. Yep, sure was. It was a good game. That spawn was ridiculous. There we go. Give me all this. Heck, come on. Click there. The clicking on some of these things is a bit rough. Go ahead and hit this. Don't accidentally leave a bunch stacked back here. Hit this. You're so chatty. This guy's probably been chatting the whole match. And we go through... Guy, you don't need to say good game will play like 18 times. Wait till I'm like about to be at the end here. And then we give him a good game. There it is. Yeah, this guy's been this guy's just a non-stop chatter. <laughs> but there it is. Now I have plenty more videos you can watch too. See you next time. Also, you'd love to see it. Forgot to say that. In case you want to see the ranks. Beginner, novice, novice, novice. Alright, we don't we worry about those ranks. See you next time.